guys okay so in this video I want to show you guys this actual um, what the Google Home mini actually uses in terms of power so what you're seeing right now is the kilowatt that's just checking the basic line and we see it's a hundred and twenty five I hope that you could actually see there 125 volts and this is, of course is the Google Home charger itself so you know what let's check to see if there's any power at all that is drained when we just use the charger not connected to the chrome of course this is the chrome here so just that you know that it's actually legitimate and um, okay let's go with that so the first thing we need to do of course is obviously we need to plug this guy in which I'm going to do now and that's it there and now we go we, we check the voltage let's see if there's any latent voltage that comes from this and okay so we look at the ampage there's no ampage right now since it's not drawing any power obviously and let's see no wattage either which is great okay so <clears throat> I'm going to go back to amps and I'm gonna plug in the Google Home here and let's see what actually happens in terms of I guess what we may be more interested in is your watts. So let me switch over to watts and let me plug in here. Okay, and it's plugged in. And I already see that the wattage has changed to 1.3 as it boots up. You could actually see it booting up here. I might be out of focus because, um, you know, it was supposed to be focus down there. 1.5 watts 1.6 watts 1.4 so it varies so the so far what we're looking at is less than two watts of power which is which is superb I mean considering that this device would be on all the time and yeah so you can actually see it's there and I'm gonna move this away from the screen as we do some testing so the first thing is that at basic um, idling you see that the device actually uses about 1. Point, let's say 1.5 average 1.3 to 1.5 in terms of wattage and let's look at amps and we can see that the amps is negligible 0 0.03 amps so very low very low powered device um, of course this will you know eventually perhaps impact on your electricity bill for the year but not really too much for the um, your, your monthly bill I'm, I'm not expecting much of anything like that we could probably just have a look at kilowatts per hour just to have an idea of what um, it, it, it does but uh, from from the looks of things it just says zero so let's go back to what all right so let's do a test if the best thing to actually see how much power is being drawn from the Google Home Mini is obviously to give it a test. So let's ask it. Hey Google, what's the time? It's 1.48. Okay, so we see for a few seconds while activated, we saw that the wattage increased by about an additional 1 watt. So we were looking at about 2.5 watts of power when in use so maybe let's try you know to, to, to get an idea a full idea of this so um, that let me may try to make Google work a little harder hey Google let's play a game okay I have a few options for that Mad Libs Lucky Trivia guess my age and more which one do you want to try Lucky Trivia Oh yeah, this is so much better than telling you about the weather. Let me get into character. Hey Google, stop. Are you sure you want to quit? Yes. Alright, see you next time. Alright guys, so as you can see, the actual Google Home never crosses about 2.5 watts so guys um, I think um, it's safe to say that these Google Home devices uh, uh, home mini devices that is are really low wattage devices I'm not gonna 
you know impact on your electricity bill that much i mean if you have to leave it on day and night so it would impact maybe a few dollars but i i don't think it's going to be much it's going to be like two three dollars us and maybe in terms of us in trinidad it will just be like i don't know maybe ten dollars more if that much um it's as i say about um 50 times less power than a normal um filament bulb it's about 10 times less power to five times less power than an, a fluorescent bulb so that, that that is really really good um in terms of it so guys i hope that you enjoyed this video please like give a give me a thumbs up at least for this so that you know the more you thumbs up the more this is going to spread to other people and help them out as well so i'll see you guys again soon stay tuned for another video where i'll be showing you another device and um We'll take it from there. So take care. See you. Bye-bye.